Well, this is an epic fail. I don't know if you can see behind me, but there's a stinking wedding happening right on this tree that I want to take the picture of. sliver of Olympic National Park on the beach our initial goal was to uh, grab a spot at the Kalalok Kalalok Kalalach Kalalok campground uh, there's a, just a few spots that are first come first serve Obviously, we didn't make our reservation last minute, but all those were gone. So we popped down a couple miles down, and there's this South Beach campground, and we managed to snag a spot there. It's a little crowded. Um, lots of vans and RVs kind of packed together, and we're just in a tent, but it's all good. So got the tent set up, the spot paid for, so that's all good. And now we're gonna go back to Kalalock and hang out for a couple hours and see if we can find a photo to take so this is an epic fail I don't know if you can see behind me but there's a stinking wedding happening right on this tree that I want to take the picture of so that's not gonna be happening good times well that was a bummer so we had sub camp Came back to what we now know how to pronounce as Claylock uh, Campground and where this uh, Tree of Life Claylock tree is. Oh wait, that's that way. Um, and we get down to the beach and there's a stinking wedding going on under the tree. <laughs> we couldn't believe it so obviously couldn't get a picture at sunset which I thought would have been really cool because uh, there's actually uh, from the recent rains there's water like rushing out from like underneath the roots and then it 
was running out to see and I think there would have been a really cool leading line uh, from this little river from directly underneath the tree that maybe would have caught some light right at sunset uh, so that was a bummer but what can you do so we're just gonna head back to camp get the rest of it set up get some food and uh, and I think we'll watch sunset from there and get up early for sunrise and come back to the tree to see if we can get a sunrise shot so. Getting a photo of this so called tree of life. So, I'm not really sure how this is going to work as a sunrise shot, but since I couldn't. Since I couldn't take a photo at sunset yesterday because of this wedding that was here figured I'd come back at sunrise and see what I can do so I'm trying to use this uh, little water that's coming out from under the tree like my leading line up to the tree uh, and then the sun is supposed to rise kind of right over there so uh, we'll see I don't, I don't know if it's going to turn out this is really my first attempt at a shot at a real shot with the a7r3 so learning still learning everything on the camera um, and all that so but it's a beautiful morning out here at olympic national park sunrise just around the corner and we got the beach all to ourselves. Books. 
So I was pretty skeptical that I was going to be able to get a shot, but I actually think that maybe I was able to pull one off. There was sort of this moment where just the sunrise was hitting, sunrise was hitting these clouds over here. And uh, some clouds just came across the frame on top of the tree. And uh, light was hitting it real nice. So took a few exposures and we'll probably combine them in post. I had to expose for the sky uh, separately and then the tree separately. So we'll see how it goes. A couple shots. Uh, it's pretty fun. Is that fun? And we had the whole beach to ourselves. It was nice. We got there probably what 6:45? Yeah. Yeah, maybe 6:45, and there was nobody there. Had the whole beach to ourselves. All that stuff from the wedding was gone. Uh, which was nice, they cleaned up really well. So yeah, I think I maybe got a shot um, and then just had some fun grabbing some B-roll and enjoying the sunrise, so it was a lot of fun. Heading back to camp now, I'm gonna make up some breakfast, some coffee, and then we're gonna hit the road. Uh, see if we can do the whole rainforest loop uh, before we start heading back down to Oregon, so.